In my time on YouTube, I have always said that I have been a Spider-Man fan or a comic book fan, and this has been the case with my past videos. So, I decided that I need to get back in the swing of Spider-Man comics, and I bought an omnibus. Hey guys, me Tom Plex here, back at you guys with another video. And today, I'm going to be unboxing the Todd McFarlane and David Michelin Spider-Man Omnibus. And honestly, I thought the box was going to be bigger, but this book is like 800 pages. And I paid a lot of money on this one book, but it was well worth it. And I hope it's in great condition. People have said it really is, so I bought the option that's new. It's a collectible. And I'm really excited to read this. And I bought the Symbiote cover variant. The regular cover variant is in like the red and blue suit, but I bought the Symbiote cover variant because I felt that was unique. The box is a little bit beaten up, but that's okay because I'm going to do it anyway. So without further ado, let's get into the unboxing and review. <laughs> I will break you. With my bare fingers, I'm going to destroy you! <laughs> smells like cardboard. Yeah, let's uh, get this. <laughs> Running into the same problem. <laughs> it's stuck to me. My spider, my spider powers have activated. wrapped in bubble wrap. Get out of your box! You okay, bed? A lot of bubble wrap. Wrapped even further! These guys actually did an awesome job, thank goodness. They're, they're really careful about this. I love that. 10 out of 10. I'm not afraid of you anymore! Oh, my fingers are sore. Ah! That blew right in my face. My face hole. There's gotta be one more in here. Hang on. Yeah. All right. So get out of here, rap. That took about two minutes of the whole video to just pop that bubble wrap. Yeah, we got the book, and it's uh in an eBay locked base. Those are words. I heard this in a hardcover variant. It's like 880 not something pages. Future me, put how many pages there actually are. I'd, I'm losing my willpower and strength. I don't deserve to be a Green Lantern. I will break you! They know I like a child, so they go. <laughs> to damage the book in any way shape or form Ooh, it's still sealed in the pa in the in the plastic wrap okay i'm happy <gasps> i see it so here's a epic transition in slow-mo This has seriously made my day. I'm not even saying this is just like a bit. I love this. Usually I always say I love the comic book and I always mean it, but I have never seen something this good quality. This looks amazing. And even the binding, it's not like a piece of paper holding it together it is perfectly like lodged in there with the book. I love that. And the tearing was a slight bit open on the edge, but it was, thank goodness it was only on like the paper end and not on like the wrapping or like the binding or anything like that. Nothing's damaged, thank goodness. Um, 
And on the and you can see all the issues on the back there. Thank goodness, I can finally count how many issues there are. Thirty-four. There's thirty-four issues in this thing, which you know is pretty awesome. That's gonna give me a bunch of time to read. But just take a look. It's taking me seven minutes just to unbox this thing, and I'm trying to unwrap it. You know me, I lost some Todd McFarlane, and I love David Michelin stuff too. I have a book by David Michelin of Spider-Man. <laughs> Eyes, lungs, pancreas, so many snacks, so little time. I'm practicing my Venom growl, because Venom is in this book. This is like, um, I'm guessing that this is going to be Venom's transformation in the series, because Todd McFarlane drew Venom, same with David Michelin, they drew the first Venom. Don't die, don't die, book, please, I just got you and I spent like a hundred, almost two hundred dollars on you! Uh, this book is rated teen. This book, I got it for more than what it was, than what it actually says at the bottom. I have a feeling this book is going to be worth it, very much so. Yeah, so on the front, you got the, uh, him in the symbiote suit swinging. The other variant that we see is, like, him in his normal suit swinging. But I figured I'd get this one, because this is sort of like an origin of Venom, maybe. Because I know it has these issues. Probably, I think. Future me, please tell me if that's right. You right. Yeah, wow. This is an amazing quality. There's no damage whatsoever. No tears. Nothing. This is pristine. I love this. Yo, let's read the back. I have, it's been a bit since I've done one of those. For the first time, more than 800 pages of pivotal spidey material by groundbreaking creators David Michelin and Todd McFarlane are collected under one cover. Michelin and McFarlane made Peter Parker and Mary Jane Watson a hip, happening couple in the middle of Manhattan. They amped up the action as old school villains such as Doc Ock, the Sandman, the Lizard, and the Green Goblin King Kong, and most important, they introduced a powerful recurring nemesis in Eddie Brock. The villain is Venom. Oh, so I'm right, this is the first appearance of Venom. It's awesome. On the back, we see like the different colors, uh, not color. <laughs> different cover variations and one of them is him with captain america right here uh right here i don't know if you can see that but um i think the first one that's a venom is uh yeah it just introduces that as right here and right here i honestly can't wait to read these these look amazing because uh, most of these show like the symbiote suit and then take a break a bit and then show the regular spidey suit and then go to venom which is pretty awesome yeah let's check out the inside Smells really good. I love it. I love the smell of fresh books. Do, do you ever have that? Like, oh wow, this is some classic art. Oh man, that is awesome. Wow, that is awesome. Imagine this is what most of like the um, like the Spider-Man series that was made in the '90s. Like, you can see this intro right here. <laughs> that one i feel like most of these issues were based off of this and or like tom mcfarlane david mclines so initial review cover initial look 11 out of 10 that's a rare tomaplex metal giver a rare tomaplex metal that i give thank you for watching me dip fawn ladies and gentlemen and others art 20 out of 10 this looks amazing story i can't wait I'm going to save that for my review of this book, and I also can't wait. The side cover for the, the side bit of this is also pretty awesome. It's Spider-Man, like, going, whoo, which is pretty awesome. I think we see, like, a bit of that in the Amazing Spider-Man movie as he's swinging through New York to try and get to Oscorp Tower. And this was well protected, so shipping and new, uh, shipping and containment. I'm not even going to remember these. The only things I kind of remember are art, story, and initial. But the shipping... What is a lot? I honestly can't wait to read this. This looks like an amazing Spider-Man story. I would really love to just, like, redraw this cover. Like, not trace it, but just look at it and, like, draw each little bit. 
I would love to do that. Just like draw this cover because it is an awesome cover. I have to say that. And yeah, this honestly just looks amazing. There are so many good villains that are being introduced. Oh, they got Mysterio. They got Mysterio on one of the covers. Okay, I'm happy. I'm gonna end it off here. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed my reaction. If you want to check out this book for yourself, it's on Amazon. It's probably like a hundred or something dollars. Uh, this was 172. Um, but thank you everybody so much for watching. Please check out this book. I would totally recommend it. I want to read it and then I'll do a review of it. And that gives my full review of it. And then you can, and then you, I can know for certain if you guys should get it or not. So thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tap my notification bell so you never miss a video from me. And then please subscribe to my friend in the YouTube channel. They do not have any YouTube videos. They only have playlists. But do subscribe to her. She really deserves praise. And just show support for her, please. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Until next time, I will see you in the next video, true believers. Bye-bye!